It's time to draw some Mimi faces. This has been a pretty crazy request. I never got this one before and I figured I'd try it being that they're so popular. And I'm gonna just use a regular B pencil and the reason is it's a kind of super cartoony and you don't really need guidelines and things. It's kind of go with the flow. So I'll hopefully get two drawn. So start with one. Start with, and every time I finish one, I'm gonna kind of make the voice that they're probably saying. So start with this little line, and th this I'm gonna teach you just by doing the lines. It's like I said, there's not really a, there's not really a proportion thing. It's just kind of these funny, goofy-looking shapes. So this is a classic one. I'm also doing my own, own kind of style with it. Just going with the flow and this you have an eye. There's an eye kind of real skinny this eye. And it's got a pupil. And on this side you got another eye. And it gets skinnier towards the right side. And pupils bigger. And what's so important about this one is you want to get, see how it's got a little line there? I'm just looking at all the lines. What's so important about this one is the huge mouth. I mean, this mouth is huge. So, like I said, I'm not copying it line for line, but just enough so you get. How to draw it so big, huge smiling mouth. You got this cheekbone here, the cheeks up. You can just see the face. So make this line dark. You got the teeth. Make this line up a little higher. No big deal. A little higher like there. Raise this line a little more. And as it gets closer to this side, notice that the teeth are kind of like goofy. They're Square on the bottom. Big spaces in between them. I'm not counting teeth for teeth like I said. I'm just going with the flow. Making it look goofy as a drawing. That's what's fun about drawing. You know, you got to take into consideration that things are a drawing. So you want it to look sketchy sometimes and exaggerate that. Like that. And this huge, huge line that comes off. Like that. And then basically the head. Very flat. Topped head with wrinkles. That kind of follow this line. As it gets towards here, it comes down. Cuts out, got the cheekbone. All I'm doing is just estimating. I'm not getting anything. It's just a fun way to try. So you can just see how I'm getting a basic shape. And then it's got kind of curves and it's got a chin. But these are fun. I never tried this before, but definitely, definitely is a fun thing just to try out. Notice how the line thickness kind of varies throughout the, the edges of the face and just comes up and gets all the way to here. 
Then you got the outline. Then all you got to worry is the little marks. Like this. Little squiggly forehead lines. Just exaggerate all these lines on the face. Just follow where I'm making the lines. Like that. And then basically the only other lines is there's some right here, here. Right on the side here. There's some here. Then all this gets darkened. Now that it's finished, I imagine he's saying something like, <laughs> It's me, a warrior. For some reason, I say it's a dig of warrior. It's like, ah, yeah, I'm warrior, baby. That's what I picture I'm saying. <laughs> That's pretty much one down. Let's do another one. These are fun to do. Let's do the laugh out loud one. That's another easy one. Make this down here. Start with the bottom. I want to go a little quicker on this. It just biggest thing about these is the lines. None of the lines are really perfectly straight. So make sure you're not going for straight lines and. Uh, you know, most of the lines are kind of just jagged, going in different way, directions, but they ultimately make this face. And all I'm doing is looking at it and just forming a basic thing. So one eye here, and even the eye, oh, let me erase the, even the high, eye, high, eye, eye, even the eye has these things where it's going like different ways. Just have fun with it. It's fun. It's fun just getting these faces. You know, this is what I love about drawing. And even though this is such a simple drawing in terms of what it is, uh, it still is fun because to have to have, to actually copy an image on your paper is so awesome. Because when you're done, you're like, wow, it actually looks like that. It resembles it. It's always a good feeling. You know, that's why I like drawing in the first place is because. When you actually get that likeness of something, it's just so awesome. And you know the mouth. Do I picture this with a do? This is how I picture this one. I'm just doing you know, the upper lip. Make sure you get these teeth. That was like horse lip shape. And these big thick lines of the eyes. Make sure this eyeball's going that way. And you got these all these other lines that creases. You know, just don't have to copy exactly every line, but just get enough so you get the laying things in. This kind of goes down. Kind of like that. Then you got these teeth. It's like this. Like that. And you can make the teeth smaller. But make sure the top of the teeth are flat and the bottoms are rounded. And a little tongue. That's another one. <laughs> That's why I pictured that one doing something like that. So I got these two and then try to get one more squeezed in on this page. Let me see how it looks. Get one more on the lot, right? Let's see, what should be the next one? I'm just looking. And finally, one more to finish it off. This one is the funniest one of all, I think. He's got a huge face and big chin. He's crying because he's so scared. For this one, I'm going to start with the outline of this huge, huge, gigantic 
Shen. Once again, don't worry about the lines. It kind of goes up. This comes up. Very small head like that. Arches down. Now I got the basic outline shape. It's a real simple outline shape. You got an eye. And the eyes like that. These little eyes are crying. To make sure you got a tear. These little tears running down. You got all these wrinkles and things. I don't want to be shy. I don't want to be alone. And a little squiggle here and then a nostril. These little like almost pig shaped nostrils. Make sure you get a big mouth. One side's like smiling and the other's almost closed. It's got all that tears dripping in. Here you got the teeth. I don't want to be alone. <laughs> Nobody wants me. And same with this eye. Uh, The eyes are crazy. They get thick. They get thin. No pupil. It just drips down. And just lots of creases is pretty much all you gotta do. See, I'm just making little lines and a couple of dots here and there. Basically, the chin though, you want to make sure you capture that chin. Kind of wavy. That's pretty much how you draw these Mimi. Mimi, Mimi, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. That's how you pretty much draw them. I hope you have fun with these. I know I had a lot of fun doing this. It's a lot different. I'll fix this huh? This is a lot of fun doing something different. So check out all my other drawn vids. See how to draw Minecraft characters and more. And let me know. Question in the comments below which which one's your favorite. Which one you have fun. And thanks everyone. This was a blast. Thank you guys.